da 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 So why don't we go ahead and just get started, shall we? Yeah. You see, the the first um the ones that we need to do. The first Halloween words we need to do are going to be uh, the date. Oops. I think I'm just going to do this. Yeah. Yeah. Halloween is always on October 31st. Yeah, that's right. It's always on October 31st. And what are what are some common Halloween words? What are some common words that we will see? Well, trick or treat is what children say on Halloween. And if they want to get candy in America, children will visit the houses near their house in the neighborhood and they will go to the door and they'll knock on the door or ring the doorbell do, 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 ling, and then they will say trick or treat and that's how they ask for candy and the activity the action of uh, uh, of asking for candy going from house to house is called going trick or treating and and only children do this. Adults adults can't do this. Teenagers can't do this. They they do something different. But children, little children, do that. And and to 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 start their trick or treating, to go trick or treating, they have to wear costumes. We don't say cosplay. Cosplay is a little different. Costume is when you wear some clothes and put on makeup and and you and you style your hair to look like a monster or something cute or like superhero or like some kind of job maybe you want to be a fire person and uh, and then you can dress like a fire person there you go you can do that yep and that's those are costumes we don't say cosplay again that's something different and, and that's going to be for another stream another stream i will talk about cosplay in the difference between costume and cosplay. I'll talk about that, don't worry. And the other thing we need to, to realize is on Halloween. Halloween is supposed to be scary, but fun scary. Fun scary. It's, it's, it's just for fun, right? Not, not, not too dangerous. And, and one of the most important elements of Halloween is the haunted house. Haunted house. And actually, haunted anything and what is haunted haunted just means a place where a ghost lives that's all yeah so today we are going to talk about scary places super scary places and and uh, i'm going to talk about five spooky places five scary places haunted places and, and one of them is in America. It's called the uh, Eastern State Penitentiary. Penitentiary is just a fancy technical word for jail. And this is a, this is an old jail. It doesn't exist anymore. It's gone. Uh, nobody uses it anymore. And, but but it's, there's supposed to be some scary stories about what happened there. Definitely. Um, and let me go here. What's the other scary place? Oh, hold on. I need to be careful. I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Okay. All right. I know this is taking a long time. I know. I'm sorry. But I want to get this right. I want to get this right. Oh, just one second. Oh, my gosh. Don't be. Oh, man. Okay. 
So the other place is called the uh, uh, Savannah Cemetery, or actually the Bonaventure Cemetery. This is in Savannah, Georgia. Uh, Georgia is an, an American state. It's considered the American South. And this is a cemetery in, it's a beautiful cemetery, but the the style of the graves and the decorations of the graves and all of that to make it look like it's a very, very spooky, scary place. Um, so definitely, definitely, uh, uh, something, something to, something to know. Let me get out of that. This should be a lot easier, but it's not. Um, okay, here we go. So just bear with me here. Okay. All right, this is a fun one. I like this one. Uh, Lep Castle. Lep Castle. Lep Castle in Ireland. Yeah, spooky, spooky castle. Lep Ireland. I'm gonna make this a little bit louder. Here we go. And um, th this is a this is a very old castle in Ireland. And what makes this an interesting castle? What makes this an interesting castle is uh, this was a, a very popular place during a a, a very bad time in UK history. There was a lot of war in the in the UK a long time ago, a long time ago, and a lot of terrible things happened in this castle. And people believe there are ghosts in this castle. Lep Castle. I I thought it was called the Leap, but it's not called Leap. It's called Lep. I don't I don't know why. Maybe it is Irish pronunciation. Um, here's another fun one. Uh, okay, let me fix this. The Oriental Theater in Chicago. Yeah. Yeah. The Oriental Theater in Chicago is spooky, spooky. Um, so apparently, apparently, there was a uh, a fire, a very big fire in this hotel, and and sometimes, sometimes you will be able to to hear the people in the theater trying to get out, yelling for help. Yeah, very spooky. The Oriental Theater in Chicago, actually a famous theater. But uh, but it's actually a, 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 what happened. The fire, the fire that happened. This was before there were there were fire laws, before that there were fire laws that to protect people. Anyway, uh, yeah, t it was a terrible situation where uh, many 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 people died, and they tried to escape and they couldn't escape. Oh, it's just a terrible situation. But 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 on some nights, you can you can hear them uh, crying for help. And I'm crying for help. Sort of like I'm, I'm a little bit crying for help because I can't get my, uh, my stream to work the way I want it to work. And then we've got, I think this is the last one. Um. Okay, no. Almost the last one. Hold on one second. There we go. Second to last one. Here we go. Yeah, the Tower of London. The Tower of London. Oh my gosh. Spooky, spooky. So what happened? What ha okay? 
what happened in the Tower of London? The Tower of London, uh, it is this, uh, this, uh, actually, you know, I don't think this is the Tower of London. Hold on one second. I don't think this is the Tower of London. I think this is the wrong picture. Anyway, why is the Tower of London so scary? Well, it's because in the old days, this is where the king and the queen would put bad people or people they thought were bad. And they'd put them there and uh, 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 it's like a jail. But but there was a no, no judge and no court or no lawyers, you know, it's just that the king and the queen decided who was bad and they put them in this place and they would stay there forever until they died. And, and, and they would do this to their own family, do this to their own relatives. And at one time, one time, the king of England did this to the queen of England, to his own wife. How horrible is that? And that's why this place is haunted. It's spooky haunted and so scary. Oh, no, no, no. I don't, I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like that. No, 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 no. That's very bad. And let's see. The last one is going to be my favorite. The catacombs of Paris. And if you look at this picture... There's a lot of rocks, lots and lots of rocks, but a lot, a lot of rocks are not rocks. They're bones. They are bones. They are people who are buried here. Lots and lots and lots of people who are buried here. Oh, so, so scary. So spooky. Um, the catacombs. What, what is a catacomb? Well, a catacomb is like a basement. Do you know what is a basement? Well, a, a basement is a room under your house, if you have a house. And these are very common in America. Most, most houses in America, uh, they have a room under the house, which is where we will, sometimes we will put our, our storage things, like our boxes, our suitcases, our our old things that we don't want to use anymore but we can't we can't find some place to put them yep and the other thing about basements oh uh basements also are usually where we put our heavy heavy appliances like our washing machine and our dryers so in many houses i can like in this house uh the washing machine and the dryer are in the basement yeah um but but if you put a basement under a church or a cemetery or in some place in the city where there's no room to put a cemetery, you want to put all the dead people, there's no place to put them. You put them in, the, in a special basement that we call the catacombs. And some of these catacombs, some of these places can be really, really big. And sometimes it's kind of like a maze. A maze is a place where you can get lost. Yeah, you can get lost there. And uh, the catacombs of Paris, no one really knows when, um, when this started. When, when the catacombs were really made. But they were made over a very, very long, long time. And, and, in, that, and in that time, Paris, the city, was a very small. It was just a village, actually. Think about it. Paris was a village. It wasn't a city when these catacombs were made. And But as the city grew and more people died, uh, the catacombs also grew. They needed to make more and more room. And then at some time, at some time, p 
people started to make cemeteries away from the city, and they forgot about the catacombs. Completely forgot about them. They were like a secret. Yeah, kind of crazy. And then one day, and then one day, there was a storm. There was a storm. Lots of water. There's a lot of water. There was there's so much water. It was like a flood, and the roof of the catacomb, the roof of the basement, a piece of it fell through. And the people of the city, the Paris citizens, they they looked down in the hole and realized, oh my gosh, there's dead people down there. There's bones in there. And what's, what's down there? And so they started exploring. And and after they started exploring, the city said, oh, this, this is a scary place. We're going to protect it because it's part of Paris history. But we are also going to make it illegal to go in there. <laughs> and so what happened is people never went inside. People never went there because it's scary, it's haunted. And it's just got dead people down there, right? And then and then one day, and then one day, uh an, an adventurer wandered into it. They, they were curious. Like, why does the city say you can't go in here? It's it's illegal. It's it's just dead bodies, right? And and as they wandered in, and also I think the city was afraid people would get lost, and they and they'd hurt themselves. So so this adventure wandered through, and he and he discovered rooms, secret rooms, where people would play movies. With the old movie technology, you know, shooting the light against a wall, so so someone made uh, spooky movie theaters in the catacombs. Yeah, yes, yeah, secret movie theaters where they would watch movies in the dark, in the, in these uh, great graves, in these underground graves. Yeah. Pretty spooky, pretty scary. Yep. Uh, and that's the, uh, and that's the uh, scary places. The five scary places that I that I find the scariest places in the world. So I, I hope you learned a lot about uh, uh, spooky places.